All right, guys. We are back playing some auto worlds, and if you remember, last time we ended up saving the van noise, and there was a little bit of an issue with the recording. So hopefully this time things are better, and you know, I don't have any issues while editing. But either way, that's all in the past, and hopefully it stays there. Let's see what we have going on here in terms of quests. Of course, you have the main quest, which I don't want to do right now. Weapons from the Void. Maybe at some point. Velma the Fishery, cool. I could do that. Oh, what? Velma Ballard, his Braxton supervisor. Oh yeah, that's the guy that the cannibals got. Alright, so both of these require us to talk to her, so let's go do that. And it's a pretty quick quest if I remember right. Maybe we can just fast travel there. I guess I have to be outside for that. Alright, let's see what Velma's up to. Maybe she's just hanging out with Scooby and the gang. <laughs> Probably not. Oh. This place could use some repairs. People actually live and work here. Damn. Sucks to suck, I guess. They're not like an, a cool interstellar pirate like us. You're a lifesaver. Hope Abigail didn't give you a hard time. Just a usual. Any word on Braxton? Oh, I, I got some word on Braxton. Longer I can cover for him either. Give me those pills, will you? Here you go. You know, you might consider a real night's sleep instead. No, meth is better, man. Look, you can tell Catherine the new shipment will be ready when it's ready, alright? She's welcome to come up here and pack boxes herself if she's in such a hurry. What? Ooh. Yeah, let's go with that. Did she now? Well, I can see I was mistaken. Because if Catherine really had sent you, there'd be a lot more expletives in your message. I hope you can forgive my temper. This job has been running. Oh, what? So she just figured out that I was lying anyway. First, my autoloader foreman stages a walkout, and now my chief pescatological health manager is missing. So, your guy that gets fish for you? Yeah, I think that's what that means. I'm here for the poster is, and to tell I you that your buddy's dead. This is the dead. last time I contract for any special requests. You can tell Grim his poster came in. You can also tell him I got a better offer for it. So now it's going to Nell. That about to who? Who the hell is Nell? She runs the bedding parlor across the way. Nice professional lady. Oh yeah, she asked I did me talk about to her. the poster once. Just once. Made a real generous offer too. Can you just give me the poster, like? Sure can. If you want to pay me more than Nell's offering. Okay, how much is she offering you? I'm not paying you six hundred and twelve bits. Are you crazy? You better give me the poster, or I'm gonna like do something way worse than what Catherine supposedly told you she was gonna do to you. I got a feeling you and Catherine would get on like tumors on a pig. Yeah, Take I think so too. Then. And if I never hear another word about it, it'll be too soon. All something right. else on your mind? Your buddy's dead. That's. And someone's dinner. Wow. I sure feel like an ass now. No, I'm sure he was an asshole anyway, so it's fine. You said something about your foreman Caleb staging Harris a walkout or whatever? Run the autoloader operators. He thinks I don't pay them enough for flipping switches and turning dials. Well, he do you? his whole crew walked out. Say they won't come back unless I pay them more. I'll go talk some sense into him. You mind slapping him around a little while you're at it? I'm joking. I don't know, I'll definitely slap him. Unless you can do it without hurting his job performance. I mean, like, he needs his hands to, to flip switches and stuff, so... I'll, make it worth your I'll leave his hands undamaged. Check the Yacht Club. He's usually there. Yacht Club? Alright, got it. So, hold on, I... Picked up, like, a bunch of random side quests or whatever, like... So, I gotta go tell... The guard? Whatever his name was? Yeah, this guy. Tell him that his poster is all ready. Have you had time to check on that poster yet? Yep. I keep wondering if it's come in. Well, maybe you should go talk to her then. But yeah, it's here. Would you look at that? The Rizzo's logo is nice and bright, and you can still smell the ink on Mr. Holcomb's signature. 
I can't thank you enough. Still, you can have the bits I was going to spend at the bar this week. All right, you know I'll what? go spend them for you. Toss ball blocker too. Never get the chance to use it these days. Ooh, nice. No love. Thirteen thousand XP for just. Okay, nice. I'll take it. Maybe we could go for some more stealth. The guns can hang on for now. It's it's maxed out at fifty, so I'll do the individual stuff later. And he did give us a toss ball blocker, so you know what? Let's do five and five. Our lying is at a hundred, though, which is amazing. I'm just gonna be lying my ass off to everyone that I meet. Great. Now for whatever this situation is. I don't think I'm even in the right place. Hold on, hold on. What are you directing me to do here? Aha! I hate when that happens. Why do you keep doing that? Okay, that's it. And... Is that all I have to do? Yeah, I, I guess so. Yeah, the poster and then the, the walkout. So it was here. Okay. New face, huh? You from off world? What sort of question is that? I don't need to answer Nothing you. At all. Just like to be friendly like with newcomers. It's the MSI way. Okay. Why don't you grab a chair? Oh. Okay. Sit a spell and revel with us. Alright, dude, you're being too nice. Kinda suspicious. Either way, Belmont told me to come and talk to you. Sure thing. What did you want to discuss? You gotta go and do your job. Because if you don't I go don't back, like, for anyone's head on a pike. I'm gonna Velma do something really bad to you. Been cruel to us. Fine. I guess we'll go back to work to save Velma's job. We'll find a better time to negotiate our wages. Tell Velma not to worry. We'll look out for her. All right. That was pretty easy. You just tell them that you're gonna do something bad to them, and then they're like, "All right, all right, man." What? A rap musk? Is that like an aphrodisiac or something? I think like one of the guys on in Roseway was talking about that. Either way, Velma, Caleb's gonna be back. You knocked any sense into him yet? Oh, I didn't touch him. I just told him that I would, and then he was fine with it. Oh, did I do that? Did I tell him that you were gonna lose your job? Okay, I guess that's well, what that's happened. Awful nice of him. Yeah, so maybe you should be nice. Sure wouldn't have that, expected right? that. Thanks for I thought I was intimidating him. You've got me out of a tight whatever. spot here. Take this for your efforts. Honest work deserves honest pay. And apparently, eleven thousand XP. Oh, I know who Catherine is. I don't. I need to go talk to her anyway. Yeah, she's like the sublight. Person in uh, Fallbrook. I think that's what it, I haven't played Outer Worlds in ages, man. I don't remember much of this, but yeah, I think that's what it's called. It's Fallbrook, like it's way down south. Yeah, that's the one. So maybe, yeah, let, let's take a walk. Try to keep it balanced because so far we've just been talking to people and hopefully I can like edit this down to where it doesn't take up too much time because I don't know like maybe I'm wrong and you guys can correct me on this but like I don't know if you want to see like just conversations all the time like because that gets kind of annoying because most of the people say the same thing you know. It's like, oh, I have this sort of a problem, and then you gotta go talk to people, or lie to them, or intimidate them, or just, like, attack them. And then problems get solved, and then you get XP and money. Usual stuff. Yeah, let's take a break from all of that, get out in the wild, and kill some raptodons and marauders and stuff. But I remember, like, the last time I did that, like, everything was just dead. I think we're not gonna find, like, too many people anytime soon but as we get closer to Fallbrook and areas that we haven't been to before I think things will just start kicking off all right Fallbrook's straight ahead we're on the right path guys I mean obviously we were gonna be on the right path because I'm following this marker real interesting this stuff yeah right, let's just run hello there mantipillars I don't know if we faced any in this game. I've sure done that like in my own playthrough of this game. Which I haven't finished completely by the way. 
Oh, Mantasaurs. Oh, Mantasaurs. Is that... Oh, that's a shotgun, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, shit! Pause one time. Get out of here. Hey, not cool. You wanna try that again? Oh, I guess you do actually want to do that. Don't you die, dude? Hey, no, no, you stay away from me. I hate those things, man. Maybe I should consider um, turning up the difficulty pretty soon, because I, initially I turned it down because I didn't know much about the game and, you know, I only had like a light pistol or something. But now, like with the plasma rifles and your hunting rifles and stuff like that, it's pretty pretty easy, so maybe I should change that. Watch me miss this thing as I say that. Oh, nope. Didn't miss that. Definitely didn't miss that. Come on. Let's try this only with this sniper. Nice. Oh, that's every. Ah, come on, don't duck. How am I? What? Okay. Whatever. What? We're, like, basically at Fallbrook already? Dang, son. Ew, who's that? Oh, MSI guards. I was about to, like, just open fire again. <laughs> hey, that's Lenora! Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I remember you. Thanks again for getting me away from those marauders. Oh, uh, yeah, last sure. time I was in the city, Sanjar was singing your praises about a bolt something or other. Suppose yeah, it was a form. A discount. You yeah, I mean, you said you were gonna give me a discount anyway for saving you from the marauders. But, whatever. I don't need to hear your story. Because, frankly, I don't give two shits. Anything better than what I have? Probably not. More than better? Hold on. Let's go to this. You can't really beat this just in the, the sheer look of it. So, yeah, you can keep your shitty equipment. Time for a round of whist. Or a round of whiskey. Or both. Drinking, gambling, and organized crime. Everything you need to keep civilization running. I swear, like, if they didn't give me, like, extra carrying capacity, I would have just... I would just toss them. Just tell them to leave. They talk too much. Like, every single place you go, every thing you buy, whatever, like, they have an opinion on it. Hey, whoa. You look sick or something. Uh huh. You blind, fella? Or can you not see I'm busy? Why is it every sisty pig fella who the? Whoa, into whoa, my town whoa, expects whoa. To get a hey, language. Welcome to Fallbrook. I don't Only expect any of that. This entire law forsaken land. Like a All right, sh animal. shut it. Just as I take this drink of water, I'm gonna have some choice words for you, old woman. I was gonna call her young lady, but I don't know if she's like 25 or like 80. Could be anywhere in there. Nice to meet you. No. Yeah, it's a piece of shit, your whole city. You know, I ain't heard that one before. Suppose I'll have to work harder to show you just what makes our town shine. But first, I'll need to know what brings you, stranger. Well, I'm half listening. Well, <laughs> We got that in common. I'm half listening to you too. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Might be I know something about it. Might be someone hired my crew to blind drop supplies on the northern bridge. Might be they sure. Oh, that's like really high. close to here. Now I remember I this. It, I ain't heard from my delivery team in far too long. Find them for me, and I'll pay you handsomely. All right. Catherine's great, ain't she? She'll pull you out of the sulfur, so long as you don't mind being in her debt. I'd have a drink. I'll shut up. Still, her? still doing that, alright. Don't keep one hand on my gun and the other on my bit cartridge. You see what I mean? Like, as soon as you talk to Catherine, and both your companions have to tell you what they think about Catherine. I don't care. I have my own opinions on them, and I'll keep them to myself. And I would appreciate if my companions did the exact same. But no, they gotta be like, ah, Catherine, she's like really cool, but then like, you're in her debt, or 
You should go drinking with her, but make sure you don't let her steal your stuff. Or shoot you. I don't even know why I'm like being so like pissy with my companions. <laughs> it's just that like with stuff like Fallout or any of the other games that have companions. Your companions do talk, but like not nearly this much. Oh shit, here we go. Whoa, hey, hey, you stay away from me. Good job, Ellie. You say that's the last of them, but you and I both know that's not the case. Oh, hold on. There's marauders up there. Yep. There you go. That wasn't too bad. Come on, guy. I, my headphones like messing up, so like I, I only have like one hand to shoot with. There you go. All right, that's better. Okay. Look, I didn't mean what I said about your outfit. It's very fashionable, I swear. Oh, oh shit, who did that? And why? That's just unfortunate. Oh well. Doesn't much matter to me. I'll kill whoever's responsible. Not to get revenge for the scientists or any of that. Just cause. That's something fun to do. Hey, hey, sword boy, stay away from me. I'm dealing with like this little pyro over here. There you go. Is anyone in here? No. Whoa, hey, hey, hey. How are there two ringleaders? Should only be one. Hold on, that's just. I haven't used this slow motion in a while, so. Oh, sorry, Ellie. What'd you guys do downstairs, though? Okay. What's going on here, then? Research data. Transfer files, of course. First, just always transfer files. Cool. Now let's see the messages. From N. Sanders. Miss Valdez, just reporting in to let you know that the lab's all set up. We found a good sulfur pocket to drill into, so the data's coming in, but this place smells awful. Well, it's full of sulfur, so what else do you expect? The only local we've had contact with is the sublight boss in Fallbrook. She doesn't ask questions, but I'm pretty sure she's gouging us, and we're all getting sick of expired sister bits. Okay, maybe we don't do shady shit then. Sanders, it's supposed to smell awful, that's the point. I don't care what sublight is charging as long as it keeps your presence there quiet. If word gets out, we're gonna have to spend the rest of our lives in corporate re-education seminars. Is that like jail? Maybe it's worse. I don't know. Seminars sound pretty boring. I don't wanna hear from you again until you have a working formula. Once you've got that, you and the rest of the lab rats can come to Byzantium and live in, on cacao ribs for all I care. From Valdez again? Okay. And come up with a better name for the project. Something flashy and catchy, but the rest of the management will take seriously. Maybe water the word danger burn. I'm sick of my boss asking me why I'm forgetting to fill out my part of the report. What name did you give it though? Alright, project titles. There you go, that's what I was looking for. Oh yeah, not having a problem. <laughs> okay, I, I just saw fucking Valdez right up front. So that's that's always a good thing. If Valdez wants a better title, let's see how she likes these. JP, she's gonna be furious if she ever finds this list, and I'm not, and I'm not covering for you. Make sure these are good and hidden. So he just about encrypted it a little bit. Cool, Thunderdog or Thunderdog, one of the two. <laughs> Eggs Mayhem, Skunk Parade, 
<laughs> I want my raise in fuck you Valdez. I think they should have gone with fuck you Valdez, but that's just my... Or Thunderdog. Cool. Is that all I have to do? Is find out that Sublight is doing stuff in here? What's this? Hacking skill too low. Oh, 95, but damn. Dude, that looks fancy. Alright, maybe at some point I'll be able to unlock it. Or maybe there's a card around here somewhere. I'm not looking for all of that right now, man. Let's just go back to Catherine. Or hold on, what? Oh, or to Sanjar. Alright. I feel like most episodes are. <laughs> maybe I'm wrong, but I feel like most episodes end with like me talking to Sanjar about something or the other. But he's a good guy. He means well, at least. Yo. What up, man? Oh, Long time no see. Reviews from across the company. What me? Can I do for you? Why are you guys reviewing me? I'm not an employee. I found out all about UDL secret Excellent experiments. On your part. I worked my fingers to nubs, but I finally completed the Bolt 52 form. I dare say it will be my second greatest achievement after the reformations. All right, you You're getting can ahead do that. of yourself again. So I am. Do you have this cartridge? Oh, no, 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 I just found out about it and then just threw it in the wild somewhere in the random sulfur pit. Of course I have it. I knew there was something going on. This is exactly the proof we need. The board will have to welcome us back now. Ooh. I'll transmit this data along with the completed Bolt 52 right away. After that, we'll sit back and quietly wait for the board to respond. That means no more broadcasts from us. Okay. Cool. Did I get XP? Money? Anything? No? Well, that's just sad. Alright, that was pretty decent. Maybe it was too long, maybe it was too short, who knows? But, overall, I think we got enough stuff done. Enough relevant stuff, anyway. And a lot of irrelevant stuff. So, I think I'm gonna call it an episode right here, and see you guys next time. You know, the more of those spectrum bottles I drink. Shut up.